Hi, so I'm making this video to explain how to download the data for uh, for the train, uh, trend line map properly. Okay, trend line map is a signal calculator, and, uh, and we need to have a good quality of data to be able to download it. Okay, to be able to arrange it properly. Let's suppose let's take a, as an example we are going to analyze GPB card pair. Okay, let's put here. Okay, as you can see that the data is coming. So first step, we put the pair at the monthly time frame and we wait until the data is downloaded. Okay, it's, it's this downloading. Okay, the data is still downloading. Just wait until it's fully downloaded. As you can see, the data is coming here. You see? Perfect, you think we are down. Now we refresh all the time frame. You see, first step refresh. Next, the uh, chart appear. Refresh, chart appear, refresh, chart appear. If you get back here, you see that we have all the data now. It's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now uh, let's uh, put the trend line map indicator. Let's enable those. Those uh, four time frame and we put here GPB cat. Okay. Let me may I uh, want just to improve the um, make it more bigger for my screen. Nice. Okay, so the pair analysis will appear here. Let me do another pair. In the meantime, that's calculated. So here we put just a minute. We duplicate, we put monthly. So the monthly is under downloading here, as you can see. Perfect, here the signal appear. Okay, it's calculating perfectly here. Okay, as I say, it's very important that we have a good quality of data and we have all historical data to run the signal calculator properly. Okay, now I'm 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 doing uh, I'm duplicating the same thing with GPB CHF. Perfect. Uh, not, not still not yet down, uh, downloaded. Let's wait and see. Okay. Perfect. I think we are down now. Let's update all the time frame. Now all of them is updated perfect. Let me go here to add GPP session. Okay. Now we have that GPP session, and we need to do the same step for all the pair that we will uh, analyze. Okay. I mean, all pairs that we will analyze, we need to, to, to download the data of those pairs and then we add it one by one to the, to, uh, to the trend line map indicator. Okay, so to keep it uh, faster 
and calculating properly uh, the performance of uh, the array that appearing intrinsically. Okay? As you can see here, it's appearing. Okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Here, as you can see, so uh, we have set up, uh, we have done an example for EPB cards, EPB CHF, and you do the same thing for all the pairs that you want to analyze. Okay, thank you.